Right as uh, Terry Hill brings them to the centre there. These boys are ready to rumble. This is what we've been waiting for all night. Dan, the grave digger, Digby, against Arthur Lightsart Lasiki for the undisputed title. Oh my word. Here it is. Let's go. Wow. Talk about, talk about hype behind this one. There has been a lot of hype behind this. You've got a wrestler and a grappler versus a striker. And this should be interesting to see. Yeah. Let's see what happens from here. Arthur with some heavy, heavy hands and strikes and Dan, an amazing magician on the ground. This is just where it's all gonna be. Let's see, Dan would have, Dan Digby would have been roaming up for this and so would Arthur Lasiki. Both of them equally up to the task. Let's see which, which one has the skill of the day. Dan with those long legs, I'm pretty sure he's going to use those legs in that range. And Arthur oh, very equal to the challenge. And look at this, just constant, constant relentless. Uh. Oh, some brilliant strike by Dan Digby in the clinch here. They're both looking to it, looking for the knees. Look at this, look at this. Both boys working hard in that clinch there. Dan's looking for that for the, 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 the knee pick, the ankle pick. Arthur fighting hard in that clinch, and he's got that up in a lovely knee from Dan Digby there. Arthur looking for the trip there. Both of them working very, very hard at the moment. This is prob prob probably not where Arthur would like to be, but Dan very, very happy to be at this point. This is his game. He likes to wear you down, get you to the ground, and once he gets you to the ground, then it's all in his world. Let's see where they go from here. Both of these boys. Very, very well accomplished within the cage. Let's see where they go from there. Oh, brilliant knee from Dan Digby. Arthur, let's see if Arthur can respond to that. And a couple of little sharp uppercuts into the ribs from Dan Digby. Arthur does the switch, gets him up against the cage and reverses it. Dan, Dan, Dan's looking for their Kimura from the standing Kimura. Arthur's busy looking to, to get in there, maybe looking for, for a takedown. This is intense. You can see everybody standing around. Arthur's just peppering him with a quick, quick uppercut. Quick hit, breaks from him. Arthur's realized that he needs to be standing, keeping him at distance and use that boxing and that skill. Dan just covering up and stepping back. This is some very, very accomplished fighters. Both boys very equal to this task and it could go either way at any moment. Don't blink because this could be lights out for somebody tonight. Look at that brilliant, brilliant, brilliant hooks in. Dan Digby went in, got the double, hooks under. Arthur working hard at that wrestling to try and keep getting get his own underhooks. And looks like he's he's managed to do that and stop the takedown of Dan Digby. Dan Digby just sitting there, he's waiting to use those knees, maybe try and pepper up this. Oh brilliant up a cover, Dan Digby. He's looking for that double. Arthur needs to spread his legs. Arthur's got his hook in. He's going for the single. Arthur's fighting it, Arthur's fighting it. Dan's fighting to get that hook, that takedown too. This is all about Will and who's actually going to get that takedown because that's where this is going to be won. Brilliant, brilliant takedown by Dan Digby. He does it effortlessly every single time. Arthur's oh, looking at switching him. Arthur's oh, managed to switch him. They get back up and they get standing. Dan pushes him right back against the cage. Dan Digby wants it up against the cage. Arthur, Arthur needs to take a breath. Oh, viciously from Dan Digby on Arthur's leg. Arthur knows. Arthur's looking, manages to switch it around. 
Arthur's got double underhooks. He's looking for them. You can see him swimming for it. Dan's going for that guillotine. Arthur's aware of it, and he's got that single leg up. Let's see, can Dan? Don't. Arthur must be careful. Dan. Dan can sink it from there. He's got a vicious, vicious guillotine, and Arthur eats a knee just for his efforts to try to be there. Very, very good from Dan Digby. The longer this goes, oh, it could just get, because the guys are just going to make one mistake after the other. Both of these boys, very, very vicious when they get going. Look at it. Brilliant switch from Arthur. Picks him up and he dumps him. He red goals him around. Arthur's grabbing around that neck there. This is not, this is not a good position for Dan, but Dan Digby looks very, very comfortable being here. Arthur's going to look to try and sink something on. See if he can work, work from there. I'm trying to see if he's got a, a choke on. He might have his hand. He looks like he's going through a dice or a modified guillotine. Dan's looking to pick and Dan does that pick. He picks the ankle and puts Arthur off balance. He's going for that single leg again. Arthur's just a little bit off balance. Oh, some serious. Oh, and that vicious elbow from Arthur. Those are hurting. Those will be hurting Dan Digby. Oh, those, how many more can you take of those? Oh, look at that. Brilliant balance from both fighters and poise. This is what it's built up to be. These guys are going at it. Hammer and tongue. Arthur going back to those, those elbows again and again and again. How many more can you take? Arthur managing to balance. Unbelievable athleticism from Arthur Lasiki. Most fighters would have gone down. That is hurting. Look at that. Arthur's just pouring it down. He's got 10 seconds to go. End of the round. End of the round. Wow. There we go, we have it, end of the round. Both fighters still not content to give up. Wow! Wow! How do you call that round? How do you call that? I don't know. If I had to... Oh, I don't want to be a judge tonight. I'm going to let the judges decide on this one. Because, wow, that was vicious. If you ever look, ever look at some of this takedown attempts from from Dan Digby, he's definitely trying to, trying to get him down. He knows that's where his game is going to be. Arthur knows he has to keep it steady. Look at those elbows, time and time again. How many more can you take of those? Oh my word. Look at those elbows again. Oh. That is just some vicious ground and pound. I don't know if you want to be there again because those were heavy. There we go, and we go to round number two. Let's see where these boys go. Oh, the stiff jab from Arthur to set it up. It started like that initially as well. Arthur's looking for it. Arthur's looking to take him down. Wow, some amazing scrambling from both fighters. There is some intensity in there. You can hear the people in the air. And Arthur looks like he's dropped him. He's unfinished him. Arthur's just striking away. Look at that. Arthur dropped him with a punch. Not really sure. We'll have to wait to see that replay. But that was definitely a punch. That dropped Dan Digby. Oh my word, it's all happening tonight. Let's see where. Oh, brilliant uppercut from Dan Digby. Arthur knows. Arthur's just going in and throwing him around a bit. Arthur's looking to do this ground and pound. Oh my word. This is where it is. How long can Dan last in this position? This is intense. Dan's just wrapping him up, stopping that arm going. Arthur is heavy as anything. He's waiting to sit there. And I'm pretty sure they both... Wow, that is some good work from Dan Digby because he stopped the onslaught of Arthur Lazar Lasiki. This is intense. You can, he's looking for a Kimura there. Arthur's looking for it. Both of the fighters looking there. They're in a bit of a stalemate. I wonder if Terry Hill's going to stand him up. This is pro class. I don't think he's as easy to stand him up as the other guys. He's looking for the Kimura. Let's see if Arthur goes. That is sore. That is tight. Arthur says he's okay. Wow, that is tight. He's just got to bend that arm. That's what he's got to do. He's got to bend that arm a little bit more. But Arthur has a mount. Arthur's just got to fight through it. Wow, this is intense. Let's see. Can he give up? Arthur looks like he's won through. This is not good for Dan Nickby in this position. Arthur could ground and pound him from here. 
Oh my, look at Arthur the flattening him He is striking him. He is striking him from here. Oh my, this is it. This is it. He's got it flat. Terry's going to call out. Oh wow, Arthur wins. Arthur wins the undisputed. This is it, some hype. Oh my way. Look at that fight. That crowd goes wild. Oh my way. You got to feel for Dan. He put it all on the line. Wow. What a fight. What a fight. Do you know who's the guy who was like, sending tweets at the time? I don't know. That, that's a replay when he's, when he's got him and he's just, just before he's flattened him out of the legs. All that ground and pound is the replay we want. Right, right, right. We're here with the new champ, Arthur Lasiki. Let's grab him over here. Come over here. We're just going to get congratulated there from the guys that put the title up. Matt Toa and Carl Weber. Everybody give him a cheer for putting this title up in this amazing fight together. Thank you very much. Right, right, right. Let's grab Arthur here. Arthur, wow, what a fight. There's been a lot of hype and a lot of tension around this fight. How does it feel to actually have it over now? Ah, uh, relief, I think. More than anything, I'd just like to um, thank my trainers, Jace, Polo, Ref, uh, Sam, all my sponsors out there as well, um, Construction Cost Consultants, and um, Park Lane, uh, Cheryl, Bennett Designs, um, Strength and Balance, oh, there's too many names, and my partner, Tess, thank you for being there. <laughs> Wow, so what a fight, man. Let's, let's take it back from the beginning. How did, you, how did you find the fight overall? I mean, did Dan surprise you with anything? Oh, shit, he's strong. He's very strong. Oh, it's just tiring, really. But... So let, let's, let's go and have a look back at that replay, because I want to know what you were thinking at that point, when you, just as you were about to take his back. Uh, I knew my arm wasn't in danger. Uh, I just had to basically wait until he's gassed out, and then I could really move. But. Ended up taking his back, and there's nothing much you can really do when someone's got their hooks in and putting pressure. So, yeah, cheers. Yeah, man, that was a very, very impressive performance. And I mean, there's a lot of supporters here for yourself. I mean, I just Thanks. want to give a hand out to them. Thank you guys for coming out. All well, the Next Generation crew as well. Thank you for coming. Very, very nice. Everybody, give a big cheer. Arthur Matsatasiki, your new undisputed New Zealand MMA champion. Oh, <laughs>